Gadoosh. Now I reckon y'all are wondering why I gathered y'all here today. It seems to me that there's a lack of morale amongst you. And so, for the sake of synergy and cohesion, I hope to get to the bottom of it. I am most concerned about the gender dynamics in the field work. I've noticed that there are very few women in executive cotton picking. Now, Rebecca, I would love to get your take on this serious issue. Well, sir, I said about doing like you said, talking to the ladies about the implicit bias inherent in the selection of leadership to open a dialogue. Amazing, Rebecca. You know what else I like about what I just heard? She was honest, specific, and... Heart smart. Heart smart. That's right. Does that mean I can get you to look at those freedom papers? Okay, okay. Let's go ahead and move on. I want to hear from everybody. Uh, um, coffee. Are there any microaggressions that you would like to broach for us to address here? Yes, sir. Uh, I'd like to address slavery as a whole, as a moral and philosophical concept, particularly in the instances of violence directed oh, at- now, 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 now. Everyone, please watch your words. Some of this violence talk can be quite triggering. Listen, use the one who whipped my wife to death. Now I gotta push back on that, okay? Please use I statements only and refrain from using some of those hurtful ad hominem attacks, guys. Also, the past is the past. How are we gonna have a meaningful conversation if you keep talking about your dead wife and my murdering of her? An eye for an eye makes the whole world blind. <laughs> we learned that the hard way, didn't we, James? Uh, I have a suggestion. Mm -hmm. What about the hot box? Now, James, gotta stop you there. You know I hate that loaded term. It is a thermal isolation chamber. Oh, come on. And it is quite relaxing. <laughs> Not that I've been in it myself. Great, uh, so Sadie is gonna come by your cabins and distribute some feedback forms. Go ahead and fill those out as if you weren't terrified that I would kill you with my two bare hands, okay? Great. Let's go and close it out the way we always do with a simple trust exercise. In three, two, one. Oh my lord. <laughs> I guess I won't have to use this. Get the gun, get the keys, let's go, let's go, let's go. You know, I think we all learned something today. I'm gonna have to tell Sadie five out of five.